Now to a deadly scene in Delaware. A medical helicopter crashes about a mile from the Newcastle County Airport. The pilot, the only person on board, was killed. The Penn Medicine chopper went down behind a post office on Quigley Boulevard. Eyewitness News reporter Anita O is live near the scene tonight. Anita. Yuki and Jessica were being kept at a distance, but are getting a better sense of the damage here. Several cars parked nearby are covered in mud. One of them, the back windshield is even shattered out. And now authorities are working to investigate exactly what brought this helicopter down. And I heard this. And then I looked up in the sky and Marion uh, Williams saw the helicopter nosedive. I heard it explode and then I I saw the scoff of black smoke. It was terrible. It's still I'm still shaken. Just before noon Thursday, a medical helicopter crashed on North Quigley Boulevard near the Wilmington Airport, killing the only person on board, the pilot. I'm still shaken about it and I'm sad because I think there's a, a life there and it's gone. Eyewitness News has confirmed the 37 year old pilot from Franklinville, New Jersey, was in the middle of a training flight when it crashed. The pilot, who was employed by Metro Aviation, had flown from the Atlantic City Airport and was conducting training in the area of the Newcastle County Airport. The chopper is operated by Metro Aviation and provides services for PennStar, which is used to transport patients in the University of Pennsylvania Health System, though none were on board. Delaware State Police say the impact of the crash sparked a fire, which spread to an empty building nearby, but only caused minor damage. Nobody on the ground was injured. And right now, a live look at the investigators on the scene. Delaware State Police and the FAA are handling the investigation, while members of the National Transportation Safety Board are en route and are expected to arrive here shortly. At this time, they are not identifying that victim. But coming up at 6.30, more witnesses describe what they saw, the scary moments this helicopter came crashing down just yards away from them. Live in Newcastle County, I'm Anita O, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Anita, thank you.